Hi, this is Ben from Literature Review HQ and this is part of a video series in which I'm demonstrating some of my some of the, the features from my favourite mind mapping software, iMindMap. Uh, if you want to get a hold of this, there's a free version and a free trial available if you go to www.literaturereviewhq.com forward slash iMindMap. Now, I'm going to demonstrate one of my favourite features about this program. Um, it used to be that I thought that drawing mind maps by hand was was simply the, the best way of doing it. If I wanted to do a really good mind map, I'd, I'd always do it by hand. I'd use digital mind maps for certain things, but really, if I, if I really wanted to get the, the benefits of doing a mind map and getting ideas down on paper, I would use a pen and paper. However, I don't actually think that's the case anymore um, because of the features of this software which are absolutely fantastic um, if you go to the top left hand corner and click on draw and then click freehand you'll see that you can actually draw the branches freehand as you will be able to do on pen and paper now I'm just using a mouse and a, not a mouse a trackpad on a, a laptop here to do this so you don't need any fancy graphics tablets to be able to, to get the effect you simply just click on the middle bit there and draw out the branches you like and you can be as creative and crazy as you want you can do the, the branches in any any way shape or form you can make them curl round on each other you can make them overlap you can do literally whatever you want and this is a phenomenal feature um, because you can be as creative, you can be as creative, if not more creative than you would be on a, a normal mind map. Um, the reason I say more so creative is because it's simply quicker to create the branches. So if you have a lot of thoughts going on in your head, you can get them down on the mind map as quickly as possible. So as soon as you've drawn a branch, the branch is selected and ready for you to write something on there. And then you go back and you draw the next one, and that's selected. And you know, you simply type away and <clears throat> you basically have all these ideas then in a mind map and the you can you can then change them about, you know, you can alter the the the, the direction, the way that you you orientate them, you can copy and change branches, you can change the size, you can edit all of these branches by changing these blue buttons as I've shown in previous videos on my YouTube channel which is Literature Review HQ um, and it just means that it's it's incredibly incredibly flexible um, now I've done stupid examples here just to show how flexible these branches are but it really does mean to me that you can actually create a mind map that's better than a, a drawn one and then it's got all the the additional benefits of being digital so you can put links in there you can link to websites and files you can share them, you can save them and copy them uh, and send them to people. Uh, you can uh, I've shown that you can actually do presentations with these and, and you can do 3D mind maps using this software. Um, and and it's, it, it, it's just mind blowing. I'm going to be using this a lot in the future to organise my ideas and this will mean that I, I won't be doing as many uh, as many mind maps on on paper on pen and paper so it's uh, additionally better for the rainforest <laughs> but um literally this this feature is very very powerful and it just it makes creating a mind map so much more fun so much more intuitive and so much more organic the ability to draw these branches by hand um so for this for this reason alone this software is is the best mind mapping software that there is um, and I thoroughly recommend you check it out there's a free trial if you go to um, www.literaturereviewhq.com forward slash imimap you can download the free version of this and a trial uh, of some of the more expensive versions there are a few versions This, the ability to draw these freehand branches is only available on some on, on the premium versions but the cheaper versions do have it it's not like you have to pay a lot of money to get this feature 
and um, you get a free trial of it anyway with the basic free version. So head over to uh, www.literatureofuhq.com forward slash imymap and get yourself a free trial and try out this amazingly cool piece of software uh, which I am going to be using all the time. Thanks very much for listening and uh, check out some more of my videos.